Hello everybody and welcome back to the Warnick Family Farm. My name's Edward, if you're new here, we are on day 206 of Family's Farmhouse Build. I wanted to share some updates. Uh, we've actually had quite a bit of things happening, pretty exciting to share with you uh, that's uh, since our last video. So uh, let's go over what those things are. So one of the first big ones was is we had the electrician here and he put down most all of the uh, switches and plugs throughout the entire farmhouse. So you'll see these all installed, all the outlets, the switches, they have put those down. Uh, he's done a little bit of work on the outside of the house, getting ready for the power to be set. Uh, we ran into a little problem with that, but we'll talk about that a little bit later. Um, the next thing I wanted to show you all is that we are, had our tile guys finished up about 90% of the tile. Um, so here is the kids' bathroom, so we're grouted. We just have this area here that hasn't been done. Now let's walk on over to the master bath. Check that out real quick. So here we go, is the master bath. We have the tub area, grout's down, that's all finished. And then of course we have the master shower. So we had, I think last time, uh, is there a, no, oh, that's pretty much done. I think that needs to be wiped off one more time, but we have our seats, soap area, um, shower's completely done. Again, more switches, GFIC, all the light switches are put in. So that is all done, very exciting. We also had more tile completed on the shower in the uh, finished room above the garage. We'll go take a look at that. Okay, we are in the finished room above the garage now. We have our shower up here. This is pretty much done. We've got the grout in on the floor. This one does have a, uh, a lip that goes into it, but shower is in, uh, floor is grouted. Handles are all here. We just have the last bit of the soap and shampoo area to grout. And then this shower is finished. This shower is getting a glass door along with the master shower. Uh, the kids' uh, tub shower combo, we're just gonna do a regular curtain in that room. So not as uh, complicated in there. But uh, yeah, gotta tell you what, with the uh, switches and plates in, it's starting to look Really, really finished. We've got our final wall color in here. Trim in here. Yeah, trim in here looks pretty much final. I may do one more coat, not really sure. We're still missing the register vents. Um, talked to um, the builder, and the HVAC guy is gonna come back one more time, finish all this up, but he wants the, the power to be set at the house uh, before he does his final so he can power up the equipment, test everything, so. Totally understand that. Let's go outside and take a look at what's happening with the power situation. So with the power situation, if you can see behind me, we've got the panels, the, uh, ex the meter box set, and also the two sub panels outside that feed the interior, well, the two interior sub panels, and then some of the higher load circuits we have in the house. They're all set here. Uh, what the problem is, is that uh, we had the uh, concrete guy come by and set down a uh, concrete pad but unfortunately where uh, the power has to come into this meter box here, the concrete is right there. So the, we're gonna have to bust up probably eight inches or so of this, uh, cut it with a concrete saw so that the power can run straight back to there. And so we won't have any issues with that. Also wanna note paint and siding is coming along. So um, we still have to work on this area up here but we do have uh, paint now on this siding. Uh, painters got all the way to there. They got that upper part window done. Um, they're coming around to about there. So like I've said before, slow and steady wins the race on this one, but the guys are doing everything they can do. So yay, a little more progress, a little bit closer to closing in on this bad boy. Uh, thank you all so much for following along and watching the Warnick Family Farm and we will see you next time.